Media UK and I'm with the Wicked Jackals here, yeah? I, no, <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Sweet How you doing? It's all right. It's been a long day. Yeah, cracking set, guys. Eh? Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very yeah. much. Thank you. And last time I saw you was Hard Rock Hell. Oh, nice. Yeah? Yeah. So what have you been up to since then? Uh... Gigging. Yeah? Recording. Got yeah. our EP out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ain't gonna change singles now. Well. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Written um, by him and our old singer. All ah, right. Ain't gonna change. Nothing to do with us three. Nothing to do with us. <laughs> Just him and the singer. So they change your lineup since then. Uh, oh. we, we lost our old singer and then this guy took over and right. he, uh, he's done a fucking better job. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say that. Not saying the old dude wasn't good, it was just more suited to us. The old dude is good, but... Okay. <laughs> he's doing his own Well, thing. we're playing in Nottingham in a month or yeah, two we're playing. We're with, yeah. yeah. So, so, so oh, at the Rock City? Yeah. Uh, no, 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 it's um... It's like we're doing a veteran charity gig. Alright. Yeah. yeah, so it should be good. So basically, we had a singer who we loved. He didn't yeah. really dig it, so he went and joined his own band, and now we're playing. Oh, so well. Now they're supporting our band. So. There you go, Carmen. I love it. So you're from Watford, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm from Plymouth, but yeah. Okay. Oh, right. Watford yeah. Watford loads. Yeah. So how long have you you been together now? About six years. Six years, yeah. <laughs> Too long. Yeah, really? <laughs> yeah. Too long. Yeah. See, so we've been together. This lineup has been six years. Yeah. Right. We're up here on the roof, and it's uh, getting a bit windy. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm windy so, enough. <laughs> so what your influences then when you were getting into music? Start with James. Yeah. Who's your in who are your friends? Who's your favourite band? Uh, Aerosmith. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So good man. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Motorhead's up there for my influences. Okay. Motorhead oh, yeah, is up there yeah. for one of my influences, okay. yeah. Yeah, yeah. For me, uh, Humble Pie, yes. The Cult, and... Um, just, just one. Just no, Humble by the Colt and Ted Nugent. <laughs> They're my favourites. Well, and yeah. obviously Guns N' Roses, but all of us love Guns N' Roses, so it's a, it's a moot point. Yeah. For me it was uh, Jimi Hendrix and System of a Down. Yeah? Yeah, those were my two. They got me into it. Well, Guns N' Roses as well, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hendrix yeah. All of us Guns N' Roses. Yeah, yeah, saying that, we all like Doing them. So so yeah, System and Jimi Hendrix were my two. So, uh, like I said, what's next then after today? Uh, we got one more show, which is the veteran gig, and then we're going to kind of disappear and write a shitload of new stuff. Maybe yeah. release a single we've already got uh, down, uh, and come back next year with a new fucking set. You know, new tunes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm really tempted. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And uh, we're hoping, I think, to get a new EP out maybe mid next year, sort of June time. Uh, <laughs> like our last one took us like three years, so June is a. It's, it's it's a good estimate, isn't it? Somewhat yeah. realistic based on our. It's a realistic record. estimate. That's it, because you write so much, you got to get all the shit. Can I swear? We've done it so far. We'll be on that, mate. So, all right. so, so basically, that, mate. you got all the shit out of the way just so you can make room for the what we assume are going to be the better songs. So we we just got to write all the shit and get out of our system. Well, it's an EP is a good way to start, isn't it? <laughs> exactly right. <laughs> Six yeah, years later. But uh, yeah, so basically, like Lex said, we've we've got not that it's shit, but we've got all uh, we've got the bunch of songs that we want to get out, and then we're basically just gonna because we're getting sick of getting compared to, to glam because none of us are glam, we're not glam, uh, but people keep calling us glam. So basically, we're trying to sort of like mature our sound up. So uh, it it's kind of like Alice in Chains meets Aerosmith. That's what we're trying to get at. Grungy Aerosmith. I know, right? It's yeah, like okay. Aerosmith yeah. and Chains. I know what stuff is. Uh, I think uh, groovy are heavier. With a bit of uh, Stevie Marriott in there. Oh, mate. Oh. <laughs> God, if it, one person's compared me to that, and I love them for life. I was lucky to see him just before he. Oh, yeah. bless you. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah. I wish I did. I yeah, wish I did. But Steve Marriott is my all time ultimate favourite singer. Yeah. I love him. Humble Pie, can't beat him. Humble Pie. And Aerosmith. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna right, we've covered everything. It's yeah. nice, to <laughs> <laughs> nice to meet you up here on the roof. Yeah. What a better There's a place. cracking set today. Well, it's it's where we much. belong, yeah. just kind of pushed out the way. <laughs> yeah, I think quite thrilled to play like, the inaugural Girls Fest. Yeah, it's really cool. Oh, we loved it, like, because Jodie, she's, she's, oh, she's a real supporter. Yeah, because obviously the, the rock scene, like, it's, it's not dying out of choice, but obviously, like, there's venues that are being yeah. uh, closed down, yeah, yeah, yeah. down 
and then like obviously it's, it's not that it's just up. people don't come to them anymore that's but the reason there's also many being cancelled recently well, we're from yeah. 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 London and London is just full of venues putting bands on and in saturated. London there are so many bands so yeah it's just saturated with people so no one actually attends every gig because you they actually can't. need you less can't. venues yeah, Jody, 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 yeah. Intuitive, yeah, Jody's flying the flag and she's getting it done and we were so glad to be a part of this this, this place is sold out and the first band had at least 100 people watching them and it just went up from there so yeah, you can't complain positive. it's been very good yeah, today yeah, got it, got it, got it. people turned up at the start like most like some people will just turn up you know for the main band or That's just we before expecting. people were there from the start today yeah, it was fucking yeah, good yeah, yeah, yeah it was quite surprised. cool yeah. definitely yeah. Surprised. Yeah. and they were good band for 27 days it was fantastic yeah, and we're exciting. about to go and just in case you want we're about to go see Bigfoot <laughs> but I don't know why they're breaking up they're on but now. they don't need to break up and we're going to see them fucking Bigfoot we've got the UK tour September Love them. Yeah. Great. All right. Yeah. Well, we're going to see them now. Okay. Thanks again, guys, Thanks for catching so up with us. We'll see you again. Brilliant. Thank you to Roxy. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Hey. Cheers.